What can you do if you want to dye sharp, precise color changes on your yarn without the colors blending into one another? With this project, I wanted to dye most of the yarn a teal color. So I dipped the skeins into a pan, added the dye, and worked that through. But you can see on the yarn that there's a lot of blending towards the end where it gets lighter and those color transitions are really soft. So what I did was create a dye thickener to not only paint the other short color sections I wanted to paint, but to even out the section of the dark teal to give us a sharper line where the colors would transition from the teal to the white that I was then going to dye with an aqua and a purple. The thickener I'm using is guar gum and I initially mixed it at a ratio of one half teaspoon of guar gum per one cup of water and then diluted it a little bit more to get a consistency that I liked. But this paint-like consistency allows you to place the dye on the yarn exactly where you want it without it sort of spreading and I don't think diffusion is the right term, but traveling through the yarn, as you might see if you're using just dyes mixed with water. And I'm really happy with how this particular colorway turned out. And it was fun to look both at dyes spreading a lot and then not spreading when I used the thickened dyes to actually do the painting for this project that was featured in the 2024 Chemnitz Hanukkah Special Night 6.